You see, I've arranged an escort. How impressed are you? I, I'm quite speechless. What you need is a 70s Ferrari Dino, and for good measure, one that was owned by rock guitarist Keith Richards. In 1974, Adnan Khashoggi, the world's most successful and controversial arms dealer, paid £17,561 for this very car for his wife, Saroya. And Khashoggi, then worth $4 billion, knew a good motor when he saw one. I've just arrived at Goodwood's Motor Circuit, where I am meeting and test driving my car for the Million Millier, the beautiful XK120. What made it so special was the speed we had to do uh, with three mountain passes and so on, but the car was doing 180, 185 miles an hour. And to do that speed, I can tell you, is quite daunting. But when you're 25 years old, that doesn't really matter. I find it completely amazing that this car was designed on paper in 1964 by the Italian styling house Vignali. But there's nothing fairy, flouncy or fussy about this. It is pure, chiselled, lantern-jawed butch. And to put a back window the size of Cornwall was an act of complete genius. This is a 50-year-old design that still looks such a hot ride. There was something a bit foreboding about it, a bit scary, actually. Slightly scary car, made a scary sound. And um, you, you imagine that people who were driving it were involved in things that you'd best not ask about. Go right to the edges, like right. what he said. Use the whole track. Use the whole track. I was born in the wrong era. I, I, that's why I love classic cars. I think I probably would have been more suited to being with, with all my suits than we should have been around for the 50s and 60s. The Interceptor has really caught our imagination all over again. The Classic Car Show is a 13-part, one-hour series available for international transmission from January 2015.